This tutorial explains how to use load cases in Lisa. When you have different load scenarios to analyze, instead of creating separate models, use load cases, so that the solver has to be run only once. Load cases can be used only in static analysis. A cantilever beam will be analyzed for three different types of loading. The first causes out of plane bending. The second causes in plane bending. And the third causes the beam to twist. To apply the first load case, right click loads and constraints, then select new load case. Select the face to which a transverse load must be applied. Then right click load case, and select new force. Right click loads and constraints, to create the second load case. Select the face to which the in plane load must be applied. Then right click load case 2, and select new force. Similarly, create the third load case. Switch to node select mode. Select the node. Right click load case 3, then select new moment. Next, solve the model. In the solution section of the outline tree, select the items listed in the first load case. Similarly, to view the results of the second load case, Click the items listed in load case number 2. And likewise, for load case number 3. In the outline tree, if there are any loads outside of the load cases, it will be an additional load, common to all the load cases. Constraints and gravity, must be applied outside of all the load cases. This ends the tutorial on using load cases. Please view the other tutorials on applying loads and constraints in LISA.